Well, I wanted to order some paper and some small notebooks that were perfect for fountain pens. And I found some at Bond Travel Gear, some Tomo River. This is my Pilot Metropolitan. And while I was there, I ended up doing some shopping. And I want to show you some of the things that I got. And I'm actually opening the box up today for the first time. So let's take a look at some of the things that I got here. So this is actually a real package opening. I have not opened these before. I'm excited about this. For my gear, put my glasses on. So I have a, a briefcase here. I really love this. Military spec nylon pockets. I'm a kind of a pocket guy. And it's got a very, very light, it's not camo, like hardcore Rambo camo. It's this darker camo that I really like. Ah, oh, the Blue Jays are out today. <laughs> and this opens up almost like a clamshell. And I like things that have compartments, a lot of compartments. Uh, for instance, Inside, like these little loops right here, there's rubber, which keeps things from sliding, so it's very grippy. I can put a smaller laptop, maybe like my um, uh, my iPad in here. If you like zipper compartments, you're going to love this. Absolutely, absolutely love this. It's got the strap right there. Bond travel gear. I love this thing. This will probably, because I normally carry a backpack. I'm normally, uh, normally a backpack kind of guy, and which is very bulky at times. So this is absolutely perfect. What else did I get? <laughs> it was a rabbit hole, I admit. It was a total rabbit hole. This little gear bag that I like, again, very, uh, it's got loops loops and D-rings. And if you're if you're kind of like a gear guy or gal, you're really going to love this. All right, two separate zipper sides uh, separated by a partition in the middle. I really like this a lot. Again, military spec nylon. It's just tough stuff. It's not this is not this is not your typical mall stuff. So this is gonna be fantastic. This, like I would put like a GoPro in here and anything, um, microphones, wires, things like that. And this expands just enough where I could put other things in it. So what else did I get here? Again, I fall down these rabbit holes and start ordering things, and all I wanted was paper. <laughs> all right, so this is the Field Journal. It's got this strap on it. Military spec nylon. And then this is the kind of journal that I want. Let me get my knife out here. I wanted something with the elastic band on it. I wanted something with paper that wasn't gonna bleed through. I'll show you. For those of you that are writers, and fountain pen people, I really like the stuff that I find at Bond Travel Gear. When I ordered these, you know, a lot of times there's always a, you know, like discrepancies between what you see in online catalogs and what you actually get. I love the I love the journals and the small notebooks with the dots versus the lines. So this is going to be a travel journal for me and I like the elastic band that keeps it closed. And where does that go? Right in here. I 
I won't take it out of this. What I'll do is I'll keep it right in here and just in, kind of install it to make it actually part of part of the process. I like the nice tight fit. It's not going to bounce around and the binding is going to break. I'm a fan of doing these kind of things. My my actual calendar. I have a, a actual paper calendar planner kind of thing. So this would go with me and put everything from passport and any papers in here and that would go with me on a plane traveling and if I'm going somewhere with the bag, this would go in the bag. Perfect. Another gear pouch. Plenty of D-rings. I like things with rings. Waterproof. It's got that um, uh, kind of a membrane over the zipper, so it's going to be water resistant as well. It's got the camo. It's got the elastic loops for pens, any kind of utensil. And inside here is rubber, so it's going to stay in there. It's kind of grippy. If you like pockets, zippers, and things like that, you're going to love it. And what is that? Is it like a little sticker in there? Yeah, Bond Travel Gear. Perfect, perfect little item for gear. This could end up being something like for, uh, like tobacco pipes, or what I use this one here. Well, this one actually could be used for tobacco pipes as well. Oh, here's a sticker again, like a decal. This could be good because I could put pipes in here, like for a long weekend or something, a corn cob and a couple briar pipes. And then in the other end, I could put, or actually the pipes in here, I put them in the straps, those loops, and then put like Ziploc bags of tobacco in here with pipe cleaners and various pipe tools and lighters. This is a tool roll. This will go on the, uh, probably in the storage compartment of the motorcycle, most likely, most likely. Not sure yet. If you like um, practical things like this, like this tool roll, Wrenches, small compact wrenches, screwdrivers. I would put a, a smaller tape measure in here. Any type of, um, like a linoleum knife, anything for cutting. Or I could even use this for drill bits or something like that, but I like these tool rolls. And it has that really unique way of closing and then you just pull this. Oh, we're not done yet. A travel wallet. Since I usually have things that are a little bit bigger, like I would use um, like this and that journal for passport. Look at this. You know, the, the silica... Uh, what do they call it? The desiccant that keeps things dry in these packages. And it says, throw away, do not eat. Gee, I'm really glad that they told me not to eat this. Because I was getting pretty darn hungry. And that, I'm not. Uh, I guess that was born out of something. <laughs> Alright, so the travel wallet with one of my favorite little books or notebooks.
the dotted Tomo River. I mean, you can't beat this stuff. This is just out of this world. These little journals are fantastic. They don't bleed when you're using um, a fountain pen and pens that lay out a little bit more ink than a ballpoint. So this is kind of a neat thing as well. You enjoy that. And the sticker comes in everything. So this is good for traveling. More for you pocket people who like pockets and loops and storage. And I could put the fountain pen in here. So if I'm going to a show, there we go, just like that. And I need to get names, addresses. I could put business cards in here, very simple. So depending on how busy I'm going to be and what kind of gear I want to take with me, absolutely perfect. A strap. I like the shoulder straps rather than just handles for carrying things. And you can use these with, with any of the bags. Hook it up to the D-rings and wear it across your chest. Have your journal behind you or your little gear bag behind you. Fill it up with beef jerky and biltong <laughs> and you're all set for the day. And last but not least is the pack of three journaling books. I like these a lot. I've tried all the brands and these are magnificent. I like them how they're the binding is sewn together. I mean, they're just, they're perfect. I'm going to take one of these because I have a workout journal that is a spiral bound big book. And what I'm, and I have that and I keep that like in the gym bag. And it's just too big, gets all messy. My new workout is going to be in this little book. And I can just keep this in my pocket or just carry it around with my towel and water bottle and check things off while I'm at the gym. Check out Bond Travel Gear. I'm going to put a link for everything down below. You will not be disappointed with all of these items. Just load up, my brothers and sisters. They make great gifts. Everybody loves things that you can stow, store, carry things that you can attach to other things, um, kind of like a component modular system, things that you don't have to carry in your hand that you can put across your body like that or on your belt. You can't go wrong. Give it a shot. The link is down below. And enjoy it. Organize and simplify with Bond travel gear. Be Beware of the rabbit hole because if you go to the site... Looking to buy one thing, like I did, for writing with my fountain pen, you end up buying a lot of stuff. And uh, I'm just amazed at the quality, completely amazed at the quality. I knew it was going to be good to begin with because it's higher end. This is not cheap stuff by any means. Durable. It's going to outlive me. Check it out.